Hi everybody, welcome back to Sharon from Vivid Days. I'd already mixed up some epoxy resin one-to-one -one and it had cured overnight. I'd got the red, the black, the white and I'm going to be doing some nail art uh, again in this one. I'm showing you which ones I've chosen. I've picked two different lace ones for the black and the white and I've got a nice little bird one with some flowers for the black. I'm using it on a Lazy Susan and this time we're going to use the glam art which is the glue that you use to fix these bits of nail foil or nail art to the piece of jewelry the black that you can see on the white is where i tried to adhere it like i did last time but it wasn't tacky enough i'd left it too long so here we go get out the little glam slap it on there and when it's tacky enough after 30 seconds in the uv i can pop on that little foil but thumbs up subscribe share comments always uh, welcome and if you haven't already hit that notification bell now look how cute that nail varnish was then take me back to the 80s with my day glow nail varnish <laughs> anyway i'm digressing i'm sharon i apply my um foil or transfer sticker to this glue now because it's tacky enough to pull it off and i gently go around and rub it adding a bit of pressure with that and my finger no resin or anything gets on my finger so it's okay I pull it up to the corner just to see if I would uh, applied it enough and it was tacky enough. It was adhering, but I just needed to push a little bit harder in certain areas. So I go and do that. Now, of the three that I'm doing, it's the same process here. I think I preferred it when I came back slightly earlier to the other video, which I'll put in my link down below. And uh, all that transfer came off a little better. But I do love that distressed look on the white. My favourite one. I have a little crush on this black one with these beautiful flowers and this bird. And it just looks so antique. And it reminds me of paper mum used to have on one of the walls, I think, when I'm growing up. Unless I am delusional. Anyway, let me know which one of these three you prefer. If you've worked on a project like this before, let me know if you've got any tips or tricks or if you've got any ideas to share. But more importantly, which one of these do you like? This video is a very short one, but I hope that you enjoy seeing the process. Uh, we come in with UV resin uh, to dome it. I go on with two coats with that. The first one is just to make sure it's all sealed in and there's no glue residue and the second one is to dome it and help it adhere to the bezeled edge now when i poured my epoxy one-to-one -one resin to leave it overnight to cure i stuck the open bezel to this beautiful tape and that was inspired by claire's crafty for corner and she got it for temu temu and it just adheres beautifully the only thing when you do pull it off this it does leave a little bit of a sticky residue so i came and put a flush coat of resin underneath uv resin um bless it this was the very last bit of this tub but i got every little ounce of it out of there because of how expensive it is you may choose to just dome it in normal resin uh which is up to you for me i did half and half i get instant gratification but also um it helps you work a little bit i don't know smarter this way one because if you dome it you just want to control it now when i am doming it and i am applying my uv resin i'm going in with my toothpick to make sure i'm getting it to all the edges there's no air bubbles removing any dust particles now, if only I'd listened to what you were saying there, because in one of them, you just saw a tiny little dust particle there. Should I say if I'd have listened to what I'm saying? But they're still beautiful. I am still going to use these and sell these um, on Etsy. But let me know if you've worked on something like this. What, um, what have you used? Which one of these is your favourite? I'll see you on the next video. Thank you so much for hanging out for me. And check out the description for my new channels. Bye bye.